hi to Chaco. We, uh, we have a grunt here for focus. He has a blade master for focus. We have a food launch here for focus. And what do we have here for Lucifer? He's going for death knight and he's going for ghouls. Okay, early. Is this an early death knight? Looks like it. Early death knight, late fiends. Uh, Lucifer often does his build on this map. He's going to creep, probably this creep camp. Well, the blade master going for this one. Then going back, buy some items and either go for uh, this item or do s go for magi somewhere. We'll see. Lord Night Sorrow here for Lucifer. We have Mogul the Sly for focus. Focus sells an item, sells a DP. He got he got the circlet. That's the best item you can get there. The Acolyte sees the Blade Master and the Grunt. What do we get here? Coils this guy. Illusions for the Death Knight. 3 0 for Lucifer. I think it's gonna be 3 0. We'll see. Illusion and the Death Knight walking around here. Their uh, Blade Master was creeping this, but now that he sees the Death Knight, he's like, okay, okay, I will go for the Ogre Magi maybe. Or is he just gonna buy boots and right click this uh, Death Knight? No, he's going for the Ogre Magi, buys a second circlet. The Death Knight here is busy with the Grunt. And what is this? There's a skeleton. Okay, nothing uh, serious. Where's the first Fiend? Wait, does he have a Fiend? Very late on the Fiends. He attacks first. Before he builds his first fiend, okay. Blade Master kills the ogre, gets a wand of mana stealing, not a great item. He's probably just gonna sell it for 200 gold. Death Knight realizes, hey, someone crept this. Blade Master healing around the trees, around the corner. It's an illusion. Death Knight against Grunt, what a fight. Grunt takes some more damage. We have Illusion scouting here. Blade Master going for this Ogre. It's an Ogre Warrior. Does he get another circlet? If he gets another circlet, this is going to be so difficult for Lucifer. Let's see what he gets here. He gets a Ring of Protection. Okay, that's not really that relevant. There's another Fiend. Meanwhile, Death Knight here. Working on this Forceful High Priest. What does he get? He gets more Illusions. So many Illusions here for Lucifer. Grunt sees everything. Uh, Blade Master just finished off the trolls. He's just like, uh, yeah, might as well get some more XP. He's level two already. Well, the Death Knight is just level one still. Two fiends. He's building another fiend. There's Grunt over there. There's an illusion over there. There's an illusion over there. Illusions everywhere, but he still has no idea where the Death Knight, uh, where the Blade Master is. Well, you will know now where the Blade Master has been. Is he going for Murlocs? Blade Master in the center. There's a Bestiary. There's a Shadow Hunter. We'll see Tech soon. We'll see Tech soon. A player's forces are under attack. Build three grunts, and we we have uh, okay. The Death Knight go for this creep camp for the Ogre Magi. Uses the dust, but the Blade Master isn't there yet. He's on his way though. Now Gloves of Haste here for the Death Knight. Blade Master, can he get the last hit on the first World Trapper? He has only one Windwalk after this. Gets the last hit. He's going for a Fiend. Do we have the Lich out yet? Lich is going to be there in a moment. Three Fiends, three Grunts. Four Fiends even. Okay, this uh, skeleton in a bit of trouble. 82 critical strike and it gets rid of the skeleton. A player's forces are under attack. And the grunts here killing this null assassin. This grunt is working on the null warden. Blade Master is going to help them out a little bit because, uh, you know, grunts against nulls, three against three. Yeah, the grunts will win that in the end, but uh, they take so much damage. There goes another null. <laughs> Illusionary Death Knight just showing up. It, it might be illusion, but it can't cancel healing cells. There, he cancels one. There goes the null. <laughs> Does he have one more healing self? Yeah, there's plenty of healing selves for these uh, these grunts. Meanwhile, we see Fortress. We see grunts, raiders, very standard. Meanwhile, we see uh, Lucifer going for this ogre. Uses the dust, but there's no blade master around. He's getting this slaughterhouse up. Healing ward. Uh, but here comes, uh, you know, who comes here? It is indeed, it is Focus. Zeppelin is not available yet. But soon it will be available. But he seems uh, he doesn't need it. He just walks out. Doesn't even need to TP. 
Uh, this fiend though in a bit of trouble. <laughs> Maybe he does need it. Maybe he does need a TP. The death knight is a baby seal. The fiend in so much trouble. The fiend does die. This fiend is he also going to die? There's not the coil on this fiend. Uh, I'm not sure. Like Lucifer. Okay, he only lost two fiends. He could have probably just TP'd and not lost uh, any fiends though. I think I like that better. And he, in fact, he's gonna lose a third fiend. Lucifer trying to be so greedy, trying to save the TP, but. He has three fiends. Hello. Hi ho, Mr. Chaco. Hello, KB, KB. Welcome back. He attacks his main now. Probably not on purpose. There's another fiend. Mogul just uh, getting a personal trapper here. And Lucifer just finishing off the creeps. You know, with the healing ward. Zeppelin is available now, so if you get creep jack now. Of course, it's in snare, but after the in snare, maybe you can buy a zeppelin. What is uh, focus going to do? Skill skeleton. Raiders, TC. A wormel is a bit late. He forgot his wormel, so he doesn't have the burrow upgrade yet. He doesn't have a Kodo yet, you know. But here, there comes Blade Master. He has level to windbook. He sees the acolyte, maybe. Maybe he goes for the acolyte. He doesn't have the orb yet, so the acolyte gets away. Death Knight is still level 2. Wow. Buys the orb. There is the Blade Master. Death Knight with some skeletons. He's going out. Uh, oh, this Acolyte is in trouble, guys. Ah, Acolyte is dead. And Death Knight creeping some Murlocs. Meanwhile, Shadow Hunter going for these ogres and trolls. Dome of Knowledge, he knows so much now, this Shadow Hunter. He can tell you facts that he never knew uh, were relevant. The TC, of course, bought some more healing salves. Uh, Kodo with the aura here, the Kodo Wardrooms aura. Does he have the, the orb yet? Wait, does he have the orb yet? No orb yet. Focus. Not buying the orb yet until it's uh, at 50 or something, I don't know. Death Knight's finally gonna hit level 3. Lionhorn of Stormwind, not the best item. He's getting more statues. No banshees. Meanwhile, over here. This Ogre Lord. Oh, Crystal Ball, what a bad item here for focus. He's gonna use it. And if he uses it, he's gonna use it here. Yeah, he sees everything. He sees exactly what Lucifer has. And, uh, you know, he's, he knows where Lucifer is at. So he knows he can go for this creep camp if he wants to. He's gonna buy an orb here, I assume. A player's forces are under attack. There's the orb. He has so many one of mana stealings. Maybe you could sell those and go for an expansion. Uh, meanwhile, Lucifer just going for some creeps. Sure. Do you have a third hero? Yeah, Dark Ranger here for Lucifer. These these trolls are all dying so fast. These trolls, maybe they should have just left the island after their ogre lord went down. Maybe they should have just fled. I guess they can't uh, swim. I guess they don't have any boats. Where do they go? Is there? There's a boat over here. But they don't know about it. The blade master searching, or what is he doing? Walking around. Just for going for some more trolls. Meanwhile, what did we get here? Rune bracers. Oh, what a good item here. What a good item for the TC. And now he's going for the ogre magi. Lich level 3. Meanwhile, more fiends. Okay. 49 supply against 50. Uh, hero levels are not that different. I mean, Lucifer, he might have lost 3 fiends early. He's still in this game. He might have uh, been outcrapped a little bit. I mean, the items are a bit better for uh, focus. But a good fight. Let's see what item we get here. Is it another uh, crystal ball? Or is it a good one this time? Another crystal ball? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Focus got uh, bad items. He got a lot of items, but he got uh, bad items with all the ones of man of mana stealing, the orbs, the crystal orbs, balls. I mean, the, there's a coil nova on the shadow hunter. He's still alive. Of course, he practiced the shadow hunter runaway against Happy. So uh, you know, there goes the Kodo, though. Lucifer's army does look pretty strong. Uh, he's gone for the grunt over there. The focus army doesn't look that strong. He has to rely on his heroes mostly. This uh, level 1 uh, stomp was beautiful, but it's only level 1. This fiend gets a coil. 
These, these grunts and raiders are dying so fast. This fiend is back on back. This fiend, what about him? Does he get a coil? He does get a coil and a frost armor. He's still alive. Just like this code over there. There goes another grunt. Of course, they die so fast. Uh, Blade Master in a bit of trouble. He has the info potion. uses it. Do we have more coils? We don't have coils, actually. He's out of mana for coils. And uh, there goes another fiend. This fiend over there is uh, still alive. The Kodo is being hunted down. There's no expansion. So uh, Lucifer has all the time in the world. And actually, he's just doing great. Lucifer is just doing great. There's no uh, pocket expansion here, right? No. This Shadow Hunter is Michael back. We have uh, a bunch of Berserkers joining the fight here. But the Dark Ranger... Oh, wait. The Blade Master is super low on hit points. Without a Blade Master, he cannot take a fight. This Berserker... Is he going to die? He is dead. Berserker is dead. The fiend is ensnared. What are these skeletons? Oh, just forget, forgetting about some key units. These three skeletons are important. They do so much damage against raiders, against berserkers. Uh, and the fiend, he could be... Uh, I guess he doesn't have much to do. Lucifer is 50 supply. Focus at 42. The TC is level 2 though. If uh, Focus can get a level 3 TC... Arr. He is still in this uh, in this game. Focus is 16 supply behind though, and it's not like Lucifer has weak heroes. He's he can uh, creep his Dark Ranger to level three pretty. No, I mean he's still f pretty far from level three. The Death Knight will be level four pretty soon, and he has these two creep camps to creep. Well, Focus actually after this creep camp, he can go to the creeps over here. Oh, it's pretty safe. I guess we'll see some more creeping. Some more creeping. For a while. Ring of protection. Again, not really what you're looking for as in that. I think I'm out of water. Oh, I have a little bit left. Um, let's see. Focus. Is he going for these little green creams? Wait, oh, his TC is already level 3. He just wants to fight, doesn't he? Level 4. Oh, and he has an expansion. Focus going for the expansion. But the Skeletal Scouts immediately. So we have this beautiful timed attack here for Lucifer. Actually, is it a beautiful timed attack? No, he needs to heal his destroyers. He doesn't want to fight right now. Focus wants to fight. Even though he just built an expansion. So that doesn't really make that much sense. No, Focus probably doesn't want to fight. Especially not here near the creep. Oh, we have Banshees out. Lucifer just regrouping, and if he doesn't lose the Lich here, which he probably won't because of the info potion, he has destroyers to dispel hexes. Um, kind of, Lucifer probably wants to fight after the regroup. All right, just heal up a little bit, get his destroyers back to hit points. Uh, gets Death Knight with, uh, back to a decent amount of mana, his Lich as well. And then Focus is going for an attack over here. But. Do you have raiders? No, only two raiders. Focus switch to a uh, fighting army. He cannot go base race. You see he has berserkers and kodos. 50 supply gets 66. Lucifer has a 16 supply army. So he definitely wants to fight fast, but he needs some mana. Maybe Oh, he had bottom mana potion. That's good. Dark Ranger is kind of low on mana. Lich, 200 mana. Blade Nash going for the Banshee. What's the armor on the Banshee? Doesn't want to use a coil here on this Banshee. It's important. This coil is important. Banshee is important as well, so the frost armor is, you know, worth it. This army doesn't look very strong. <laughs> 58 supply for focus. It's getting a wyvern, it's getting more berserkers. Oh! Lucifer just creeping, and if he creeps, he gets more skeletons, right? So his army gets even stronger. His Dark Ranger at level 3. I assume he's going for level 2 skeletons. Maybe level 2 silence. And this choke, by the way, it's pretty wide, but it, there is, you know, some sense of a choke there. It's, uh, but I, I think that's good for focus, actually, with the TC, with the stomp. This destroyer is going down, it's going down so fast. Shadow Hunter level 4, uh, we still have two more destroyers. No web, of course, this raider takes a bit of damage. There's a berserker, you know, berserk ability, killing so many skeletons and ghouls. The TC with the stomp on Death Knight and two ghouls, this uh, one ghoul is down. The Wyvern is, you know, taking a bit of damage there, you know. There's no web though. Is he getting web? He's getting web. Wait, the Fiends are 2-0 upgraded. I just now realized it. Berserkers are 0-0. There's another stomp. This uh, Wyvern is going to die. And hey, we built a second Wyvern. I don't like that. I like the first Wyvern to force that web. 
But the second wyvern is just a flying XP tome here, or not a flying XP tome, uh, because he's gonna be wrapped, and then it's just an uh, wrapped XP tome. How much more mana on the TC? No more mana. So now there's no more stones. This uh, Kodo couldn't really eat something because it was being body blocked by Dark Ranger, but the Dark Ranger moves out of the way, so the Kodo can eat something. Nice uh, of the Dark Ranger to do. The Lich didn't body block the Kodo there either. So some missed micro there by, by Lucifer, but I guess he's just uh, uh, microing very aggressively, making sure he targets the correct units. The DC still alive, healing wave. He has a rune bracers as well, so he doesn't take a lot of damage. There goes another Berserker. This Berserker also going down very fast. Supplies are pretty even, slightly up for Lucifer, but uh, Focus has the expansion. Lucifer has the, uh, the heroes though, stronger heroes. TC gets another healing wave, but we have a shop here as well. So with man on the Shadow Hunter, can f can Lucifer break this? I'm not sure. Let's see. He kills another. Uh, oh, Death Knight in trouble. Do we have mana for Stomp? The yes, he's a fiend though. The Stomp was just too late. Uh, he didn't even cast it because you know he figured he was too late. But there goes a fiend and a destroyer. I think that should be be enough for focus. I think he holds here, and if he holds here, he's gonna win the game because he has an expansion up and a tower and a shop. And this blade master missed there, critical miss on the lich. Death knight has to be micro back. His banshees are quite interesting. I mean, they're still alive. Blade master misses a few more attacks. The lich. Focusing the TC. 207 critical strike there by the. Oh, and there's a TP out by the Death Knight. Uh, Dark Ranger solo on hit points. She does survive. 23 hit points. There was an attack of the Shadow Hunter in the air that she dodged. It could have killed her. It would probably would have killed her. Even at the minimum 35 damage. Uh, how much armor does she have? She has 6 armor. I don't know. Maybe, maybe she could have survived with like 1 hit point if it did minimal damage, but I'm not sure. And Lucifer though, how he's on he's at 45 supply, focus only at 50, so maybe he has one more chance here to win the game. He needs a hero kill, I think. Next fight, he needs a hero kill, but of course focus is not just gonna give him a hero. Focus is gonna defend here near the shop, near the tower. What can Lucifer do? Maybe Lucifer. Maybe he should switch to uh Necromancers, Kappa. Maybe he should watch some games with TBCBM. Maybe he should go Necromancers and Frostworms. A player's forces are under attack. Okay, Master kills this guy. This second troll also goes down. Two dead trolls. There's more creeps, by the way. Focus. Wait, what are these Berserkers doing over here? You forgot about these Berserkers! Focus! Okay, moves them. He sees, uh, he sees Lucifer coming with his Blade Master. He sees the Fiend, sees the Banshee, sees the statues. Goes for the Fiend. And the Fiend is uh, going down fast. There's silence though. Silence on the TC. The Fiend still alive. No fire on the Blade Master. I'm not sure, by the way, why Focus is fighting here. He thinks he's uh, super far ahead. I mean, he is super far ahead. But uh, it's not a safe play to fight here, really. The Lich uh, is going to be fine, but the Dark Ranger dies. Is that a GG? There it is, GG. That you can improve on. We have a Blade Master here and a uh, Grunt. Close position. Over here, we have Lucifer. With the Death Knight and Ghouls and the Graveyard going up. There's another Ghoul. We have a Death Knight and Ghouls. Here we have a Blade Master. Wait, where's the Blade Master? There he is. There's a Blade Master. Something we have seen, by the way, before is uh, with Sheikdos. He sees his close position. He just takes uh, his first Fiend and his first Ghouls and just right clicks all these burrows. And just wins. He just wins games because Focus is creeping this. And Sheik is like killing his main. He's killing his everything. And Sheik just keeps winning against Focus on uh, Turtle Rock close position. And uh, But what does Lucifer do? He just goes straight to the shop. But is he too late? I think he's too late. If only the Death Knight had better movement speed. Maybe. Oh, you see that? He was just too late. The Coil did nothing. The Blade Master got a kill. The Grunt though is ensnared. And the Death Knight going for the Grunt. And uh, yeah, I mean the Blade Master going for the Death Knight, Death Knight going for the Grunt. The Creeps let the Grunt alone, so he needs another Coil, that's for sure. But he would take so much damage on the Death Knight just for this Grunt. Actually, the Blade Master blocking, but that's not enough. There's a Coil, the Grunt is dead. 
Uh, did it get XP? It did get XP. Uh, the Blade Master tried to deny it, but of course, Blade Master doesn't do 100 damage. The gun was 100 hit points. So, uh, there's no denying there by the Blade Master. Got uh, two skeletons. A player's forces are under attack. There's a fiend. Blade Master, is he going for the turtle? No, he's not. He's healing, of course. He's going for the Ogre Magi, but the Acolyte is scouting it. Look at the scouting Acolyte. He knows exactly how Focus plays this game. These skeletons, they're going down. Definitely with some skeletons. He's getting a fiend. Okay, maybe uh, Blade Master saw the Acolyte and decided to go for this one. Or maybe he just felt it was too risky to go for this one anyway. So he's going for this Ogre. Okay, the Death Knight, you know, walking past the uh, Ogres. But this Ogre is already dead. He's too late again. The Death Knight always too late. If only the Death Knight had some better movement speed. You know, if only he was level 2. If only he had boost of speed. There's a Fiend block. The Death Knight will take a little bit of damage. The Death Knight, hello Chaco, Blade Master. But he has plenty of uh, Wind Walks. He has Healing Salves. There's uh, two Grunts over there. Building a third Grunt. Is the Death Knight going to creep? The Death Knight really wants it level 2 uh, for the health regeneration, for the movement speed, for so many reasons. This fiend, does he see the grunts? Does the grunts see the fiends? I think the fiend saw the grunts. And Focus just starts creeping this as Lucifer shows up. It's a really nice time to creep Jack this time. He's not too late this time. But the fiends, they move so slow without the aura. This fiend, uh, you know, he's in the... Uh, he's just walking around the trees. Yeah, sure. Who's gonna get his Ogre Warrior? Who's gonna get the item? Blade Master gets a kill. Oh, there wasn't the Ogre Warrior with the item. Or, or did he pick up the item? Claws of Attack? Might have picked it up so fast that I didn't even see it. No, wait. I don't think there was the item. I think the Claws of Attack is what he got from over there. Um, And he bought two circlets. Right? Am I right? Maybe I'm right. Meanwhile, the skeletons and the fiends creeping here. Cloak of Shadows on the floor. Death Knight is almost level 2. He needs 32 more XP. We'll see if I'm right after he kills this other ogre. Where is the ogre? No, this... Th yeah, he did get the item here. This one does not have the item. And now we have a level 2 Death Knight. Now we have the aura. The fiend, though. The fiend is probably going to die. Probably not, I mean. This is what I was trying to say. Kappa. Death Knight level 2, the Blade Master is still level 1. But see, Lich here, there's a Shadow Hunter. And there's a tier 2. Oh, what is this? He's going for a Spirit Lodge. And is Lucifer gonna scout this? And if he scouts this, he's gonna play differently. And if he's playing, going to play differently, how is he gonna play differently? Blade Master going for the Ogre Magi. Ogre Magi going down so fast. Blade Master finally level 2. Uh, boots of Speed. Okay. Okay. Acolyte, of course, saw it already being uh, crapped. We have a Lich. We have false armor, but I'm not sure if he can win this fight. Uh, Hex on the Death Knight. He cannot coil or TP out. This fiend is still alive. Okay, no, it does go down. We have ghouls here as well. He brought his ghouls. With the ghouls, I guess Lucifer uh, might be able to take this fight. But uh, yeah, he lost that fiend so fast. Doesn't look amazing for Lucifer, but we're seeing spirit walkers. So against spirit walkers, you just want to go destroyers. Just banshees are not as important, of course, because you can dispel the curse. And uh, destroyers, they can, they're just, you know, amazing. Because usually they don't have enough to, to take out destroyers, so they only have their blade master. So they don't have piercing damage units, because instead they go for the spirit walkers. So your destroyers are pretty, uh, pretty tough. And Spirit Link can be dispelled, giving the destroyers even more mana. Is Lucifer going for this creep camp? Yeah. Does he see this? <laughs> I don't know. The War Mill? Does it see it? Maybe it sees that the creep moves away, but then uh, you don't see it on the minimap, only if you see, pay attention. Uh, Lucifer, I mean, Focus is going for this Ogre now. Okay. Tier 3 is, of course, a bit later. Because uh, because of this Spirit Lodge. 
also using a lot of lumber on the on the spirit lodge itself and on the upgrades so we don't we don't see any berserkers anytime soon and the burrows off so i don't like this very much because the burrows are also now a lot more vulnerable because this is so much later the reinforced defenses i wonder if there's going to be a timing with destroyers that can kill the burrows of course we don't have a dp here so the burrows would die so fast helm of failure here is not uh not, a, not that bad of an item in this matchup played mass killing ogre magi and what's lucifer doing he's going to kill some more turtles turtles Okay, Shadowhunter is level 2. Is he gonna creep this, get level 3? Or is he going for the turtles? I mean, the <laughs> turtles there are still alive. Blade Master is, has an orb now. Do we see the upgrade? No, he doesn't have the lumber. He's getting a Kodo, but without the Wardrooms upgrade. How many Spirit Walkers does he have? Only one. He's an ad one Adapt Spirit Walker. What did Lucifer get here? Lucifer got a Wand of Banner Stealing. I don't think Lucifer scouted. The base. Don't think you realize he's playing against the Spirit Lodge. Don't think you realize he's playing against the uh, heavy armored burrows. There's a shockwave, hits one fiend. The statue though takes a bit of damage. There's uh Coil Nova on the Blade Master. And there's the destroyer. You can coil the destroyer now. And uh you can eat this plotless, going for the overlord. Shadow Hunter is level three now. There's the war drums upgrade, there's the berserker upgrade, there's the first head hunter. What item do we get here? Wait, what? Oh, he's still alive. Legion Doomhorn, oh, worst item here that Lucifer could have gotten. Lucifer doesn't know about spirits walkers yet, does he? I don't think so. I mean, it doesn't seem like he's playing like he's playing against spirit walkers. I mean, he doesn't have a Temple of the Damned. So in that sense, that's good for him. There's a Tome of Intelligence, hello. Maybe pick it up with the Lich. Or the Death Knight. Or anyone, really. Anyone likes to read books? Blade Master, do you like to read books? The forces are under attack. Okay, it seems like the Lich likes to read books. Lich is level 3, Death Knight is level 3. Uh, Lucifer at 44 supply, but he's gonna buy a hero. Go to 49 supply. Oh, but Focus is defending the tavern. Getting a uh, creature attack upgrade. The fiends are oh they already have one armor. So soon they will be one on one. These destroy look at this uh, spirit link. So many spirit links that the destroyers can eat. And there's three destroyers now and the dark ranger. I'm not sure if this is going well for focus. It might be 56 supply against 56, but there's also no TC, which he also sacrificed for going for spirit walkers. One of them dies so fast. Uh, this this fiend is dying slowly. The code is hungry though. The code eats a fiend. Uh, makes a lot of sense to eat fiends. He does have the Kodo Wardens upgrade by now. The Grunts are dying so fast, all of them, to the three destroyers. Uh, the Berserker just showing up. He's also like, hey, please kill me. But they let him li uh, live. Do we have a coil? We have a coil. The Blade Master used the info potion. The Kodo is still alive. Of course, not, uh, there's only one fiend left, so he doesn't take an immense amount of damage from uh, the army. We still have three Raiders left, but there's, some of them are pretty low. One of them does go down. Lich takes a coil. Uh, focus at 40 supply, lose for 51, but destroyers are a lot of supply and they're not that strong against heroes though. So this raider is uh, is dead, turns to a skeleton, this statue takes a bit of damage. And uh, these units are trying to run away and they do run away. Shadowhunter in trouble! Shadowhunter, does he have anything? Yes, he has enough to save himself. He has a he greater healing potion and a info potion. Uh, these units though, these units are in danger. Blade Master. Is being focused. Oh, Dark Ranger! He just used a coil. He's out of mana. Blade Master is pretty hard to kill. Um, yeah, I don't think I don't understand why he went for the Blade Master there. He should probably just try to chase down these other units. Blade Master going for this, uh, this fiend. This fiend is dead. There's a skeleton. Dark Ranger in trouble. She's dead. Ah! There goes the statue as well. The Kodo also takes a lot of damage. There's more spirit link, but the, he just eats it. The destroyer just eats it. There's another fiend as well. This fiend is saved. This destroyer is uh, he's still alive. Oh, bye bye fiend. Blade Master just 
doing so much damage. He has this helmet failure. He has this talisman of evasion. He's pretty hard to kill, and he does a lot of damage. Plus 17 damage. Shadow Hunter. He did use the greater healing. Po oh, no, he gave it to the, sh to the Blade Master. Nice coil there, just before the the hex. The TC. There's the TC, guys. And he gives the TP to the Lich. And Skeleton goes down. Lucifer had the TP out. Uh, Lucifer is now slightly behind. He's not super far behind until we see this expansion here. For focus. One base, although these heroes are pretty close to level 5. Shadowhunter and Blade Master are going to be level 5 in no time. The Death Knight is far from level 5. Lich is uh, not even level 4. Okay, actually. Lucifer is very far behind. Very, very far. Once these heroes, like the Shadow Under level 5 means no heroes are gonna die anymore. Uh, the TC is just level 1. It's now, finally now getting reinforced defenses. Imagine if Lucifer knew about this. About these burrows that are just banging to be killed. They're like, oh, please kill us. And, uh, well, they won't be banging to be killed anymore soon. Lucifer is creeping. He needs his level 5 heroes. I mean... Blade Master is going to hit level 5. And then there probably won't be much creeping left for Lucifer. Because this uh, Blade Master is going to be so annoying. He doesn't have a shade or anything, right? No. Okay, now the TC finish uh, takes over. Plus 9 strength on the TC. Blade Master. Oh wait, the Blade Master is not level 5. Yeah, the Skeleton can cancel the healing self. And that's what he does. Okay, meanwhile Lucifer creeping over here. Rune Bracer is not very good for Lucifer. There's a healing wave. Blade Master still level 4. TC close to level 3. Here comes... Uh, oh, Lucifer knows. Lucifer knows the focus is there. So he's, he's using his destroyers. He's, he's draining mana. He sees a Shadow Hunter there. If the Shadow Hunter is not careful, by the way. If he just stands here in the back, Lucifer might be able to kill it. But Lucifer is going for the Turtles first. Blade Master going for a fiend. Blade Master has to be careful, though. You know, and that's what he does. He's uh, being careful. He has a greater healing potion. He has 850 hit points with evasion, with 8.8 .8 armor. He's not easy to kill, guys. This Blade Master. Oh, we, we're going getting an expansion here for uh, focus. This evasion, by the way, it's uh, I mentioned it a few times because it's so good. And why is it so good? Because if you evade. If you evade the Orb of Corruption of the Lich, you don't lose 4 armor. You keep your armor. Or 5 armor even. You keep your 5 armor. A player's forces are under attack. TC is level 3 now. So now we have pretty much Exodia, right? I mean, the Blade Master is like, like we can say he's level 5. So level 3 Critical Strike, level 2 Stomp, level 3 uh, Healing Wave. But if the Shadow Hunter just dies over here. Oh, he has an Info Potion. Okay. 55 supply against 59. Lucifer, I mean, his heroes are weaker. But he can still win here by by killing a hero or two. There goes the statue. Uh, not the statue. Destroyer. Nice stomp. Hits a Death Knight and a Lich. And uh, there goes this Spirit Walker guy. The Kodo is hungry. Why is the Michael Lucifer, please? Michael, your fiends. 120 with the Michael the Fiend. Uh, happy with Michael the Fiend. Blade Master going for, uh, for a Destroyer. Destroyer that does take a coil. And Blade Master now going for this statue over there. What a nice uh, attack. Nice stomp there. Hits a lot of units. Now 210 critical strike. This fiend is also dead. The raider there. Almost dead. But maybe you could kill it. Lucifer. This fiend. Oh, the raider. He doesn't kill the raider. It gets healing waved. And this raider will go down eventually. And now he goes for this raider. Um, the Kodos are just, you know, in the back. There goes the raider. Nova on the raider. Coil on the lich. This fiend is dead. Is he now going for the Kodos? Lucifer only has heroes left, really, with skeletons. Skeletons do great jobs against uh, Berserker, so... Uh, it's one skeleton left. The Kodo is going down. Coil on the Lich. This Kodo is dead. And do we see another Coil on this Lich? Yeah. The Death Knight is dead. That's GG. <laughs> Lucifer going for a Death Knight. He's, uh, he's building a Crypt. Building Tomb of Relics, building a graveyard even. 
so many buildings here for Lucifer. This Death Knight will be out uh, in a mo or not in a moment, in a few moments. He's uh, he's going for early fiends. No, early Death Knight. <laughs> Late fiends, early Death Knight. And there's another ghoul. He's building more ghouls. Look at this Echolite scouting. Hi, Chaco. How's it going? Hello, Kebab87. It's going great. It's, we have a beautiful finals here between Focus and Lucifer. Focus and Lucifer. Focus here with the Echolite. Just scouting this creep camp. Here's the Blade Master. Imagine you have to order a pizza. What's on it? Uh, meat. There's meat on the pizza and cheese and tomato sauce and some vegetables and some pineapple. Uh, Blade Master and the Grunt killing this renegade wizard. Does the Acolyte get the last hit? <laughs> no, Mikasa gets the last hit. Last hit. 92 XP here. Go for this Acolyte. This Acolyte is going down fast. Oh, another 25 XP. Meanwhile, the Death Knight go for this troll. Blade Master healing with the healing self. Rawr. Slippers of agility here on the Death Knight. He's extra agile now with those slippers. Maybe we will keep it for the Dark Ranger, but you would probably sell it before the point. Blade Master, does he get the boots of quality? Oh, actually, no matter what item you get here, just all good. They're all good. Like the what's the worst item? What is the worst one? Is it devotion aura? Is it? It is probably devotion aura. Let's see what he gets. Use speed scroll. It gets Scourge Bone Chimes. Okay. Maybe Scourge Bone... No. <laughs> Scourge Bone Chimes better than Devotion Aura. So, uh... It's not the best matchup, though, for Scourge Bone Chimes. As Orc, it's, uh... You know, probably it's the worst matchup to get it. But it's still a really good item. Still a really good item. He will keep it, you know. And he will use it and he will get so much health back. Maybe he goes Spirit Walkers again. Maybe not. But here's the Death Knight. Happy first foggy 2-0 game now. Game 3 now. Okay. We've had pizza pineapple discussion at least three times before. <laughs> it's like a standard Twitch discussion. There's a fiend. He's building another fiend. Second fiend. A player's forces are under attack. Some some skeletons. He's gonna go kill these uh, rogues. You want the blade master going for uh, first the tome, and now this other first tool, maybe another other first tool, another first tool, and a Sasquatch, of course. He gets so much health back uh, by uh, with the vampire aura, Scourge Bone Chimes, Vampiric Aura. Look at all the health he's getting back. You will the Death Knight creeping over here, kills another rogue guy. Does he summon some skeletons? He summons the skeletons. Anything strange? Nothing strange. He's almost a tier two. Over here we have uh, three fiends building four fiends. He used the dust, but there's no blade master nearby. Blade master just got a replenishment potion, not the item he wanted. The worst item he could have gotten there. I mean, he already has four healing salves. Yeah, I mean, sentry words are so good. Illusions are kind of good. A replenishment potion for orc? Eh, not really. The death knight kills some more creeps. He's almost level three. He just needs one more kill. Even this baby Murloc should be enough. Six XP is all he needs. The Blade Master is going to be level 3 after killing this uh, Task Master. Tome of IQ. Want of Illusion. The skeleton, can he cancel this healing self? He cancels it. What a play there by Lucifer. What a play. The skeleton does go down though. So 12 XP goes to Mikasa. And, uh, you know, do we see the Lich? Do we see the Lich? The Lich is almost out. Do we see Shadow Hunter? Yes. Do we see uh, Bestiary? Yes. Fortress. And where is the War Mill? One of these games, he was a bit late with War Mill. I think it was against Happy. So, uh, hopefully for him, he's not late this game. There's a frog. Quack. Oh, wait a second. Sacrificial Skull. Where's the Acolyte? Where is the Acolyte? There's no Acolyte, okay. But he does bring the ghouls. Oh, there's the Acolyte. Sneaky, sneaky Acolyte. Sneaking around the north side. And this is gonna be a Towerus, guys. The Towerus. And he might even kill Burrow or the shop. 
before uh, Focus can defend because Focus was on the other side of the map, but he does get a greater mana potion. It's not that useful because the Shadow Hunter is just level one. He rather would have just gotten a greater uh, healing potion. But uh, yeah, I mean, the shop's gonna stay up thanks to the peons. And this Acolyte is it gonna die. Blade Master goes for it immediately. Oh, it was too late. Oh, and there goes the castle on the Ziggurat. Blade Master going for the Fiend here. The Fiend gets a first armor. The Blade Master, you know, it's surrounded, but actually, there's no mana for Windwalk. There's no mana. Oh, the he hexes the Death Knight just to uh, reduce the damage as much as possible. He buys the healing potion, so the Blade Master does survive. Has enough mana for the Windwalk now. It gets out. He killed the Fiend. He's coming back. The Fiend. Where's the false armor on the Fiend? There it is. A bit late, but sure. The shop goes down. Blade Master again being focused, the Death Knight again being a crap. And there's a second Fiend down. Of course, we have this greater mana potion on the Shadow Hunter. Oh, but the Blade Master, does he survive? I see a Fiend attack here. Does it hit the Blade Master? It does hit him, but he doesn't die. He also uses his replenishment potion now. And uh, it seems like Lucifer, you know, he killed one peon, he killed the shop. But that's about it so far. I think the shop was important because now there's no orb on this blade master. There's a coil, but does no damage on the blade master because he went windwalk. How many coils have we seen miss in the last like two minutes? I can't even count a lot. No, every coil pretty much. Blade master is the healing here. The fiend takes a coil. This time it's on time. The raider dies just to some ghouls. This this grunt is also going to die. We have a ziggurat going up. Blade master 82 critical strike. And uh, ah, Grunt goes down. This fiend is still doing just fine. We have uh, three Grunts down, two Raiders. One tower got cancelled. Another one got cancelled. Blade Master is too low on hit points. Is he dead? Yes, he's dead. Shadow Hunter is uh, like, oh shit, I'm too late. I mean, oh, whoopsie daisies, I'm too late. And the Shadow Hunter now working on the Ziggurat. He might get the one cancel on the Ziggurat, but the Blade Master. Will not be will not be back for another 107 seconds. Level three Mikasa. There goes a Grunty Punty. Do we see a slaughterhouse or anything going up? No, just fiends. And he's going for the Ziggurat. Of course, they don't do siege. I mean, they do do siege damage, but there's no fortified armor on a building building. So no extra damage for the raiders until it's done. Maybe he's purposely waiting <laughs> till it's done so he's ready to do extra damage. It is done. It's going for the Nerubian Tower. The Acolyte repairs. This one is cancelled. And snare on this Fiend, but there's no Blade Match, there's no DPS. Hello, the Fiend doesn't take any damage. This Grunt, he couldn't move the Death Knight down, because the Grunt obviously is going to move to the left, but uh, actually no micro on the Grunt. Uh, this Ghoul goes down, and the <laughs> Grunt moved to the right, because everyone moved to the right. There was just no micro on the Grunt. This Fiend could use a Coil. There's no blade master, so he has all the time in the world to give to, to throw this coil. There's a spirit tower going up. Blade master will be uh, back in some moments, but these towers will be up already. We have five raiders though, uh, and they're going for this uh, spirit tower over here. One raider is dead. Do you have Nova? We don't have Nova. This raider is taking quite a lot of damage. Quite a lot of damage. He's going for another Nerubian tower. This raider is dead. He's going for this raider next. This grunt is just trying to kill this fiend. There's another instant on the Fiend. We have Frost Armor. He Frost Armors the Fiend. This Raider does retreat. A coil on the Fiend so he doesn't die. The this Raider also retreats. Can take quite a bit of damage. There there's a Blade Master. Blade Master is back. Just focus still have a chance. 32 Splag is 34. Towers are up. This Fiend is up. 4 and 2 levels against 3 and 2. But Mikasa, I mean, some crits. And uh, Mikasa is back in the game. Lucifer is back in the game. Do we have a coil? No more coils. So the Fiend just dies. No backpack either, does he? No, no backpack. There's uh, false armor. If he had backpack, a fiend could bring a mana potion. But without mana on this death knight. Also, the shadow hunter's out of mana as well, though. There is the tomb of relics. So instead of going for the backpack, he just decides to build a shop over here. This fiend has to be careful. This grunt is going to die. Ooh, ah. Oh, look at this careful fiend. Making sure he doesn't walk over here and die. What does Death Knight just buy? Nothing. Oh. Okay. Go for a burrow. Tomb of Relics is going to be cancelled. So no mana potions here for Lucifer. There's mana for one coil. There's a frost armor as well. On the Fiend. This Raider is taking so much damage. Coil on the Fiend. The Fiend is still alive. 
Well, the raider's dead, but this tower takes so much damage. Does he have pillage? I don't even know. There goes the second raider. This uh, tower will die. And this, so will this fiend. There's another fiend, though. And this fiend, this raider is dead. Another shop is being built. This grunt. The Nerubian tower, though, is the most important tower, of course. It's still up. This grunt's going down. He's just uh, building raiders. Blade Master is being slowed now. What's the radio and snaring? Nothing, because he's going for this shop again. Doesn't want this Death Knight to get any mana potions. Uh, Blade Master's super long hit points. He has an info potion. There's a healing wave again. It's just level 1. He's almost level 3. If he gets one more kill, doesn't matter what it is. Level 3. And level 3 is going to make a huge difference. Where, where's the coil? Hello? Lucifer! Doesn't decide to save the fiend. Use the coil on the da Blade Master. Okay, that's fine, you know. That's fine. You know, as long as he has a reason to not coil the fiend, it's fine. GG. And Lucifer wins a game, guys. And Voodoo Launch over here. This is always so interesting to not uh, build your barracks over here and your Voodoo Launch over here. Uh, although, you know, it, you could do that. The thing is, like, if you rally your, your barracks over there, your grunts sometimes get stuck over there. We've seen this so often. So he just uh, builds a shop over there and the barracks over there. Also, his shop is a bit, bit safer. It doesn't make a huge difference. Especially not against fiends, but uh, yeah, it's a bit safer. It's also closer to the peon, so easier to repair. And usually, even that attacks your base or really anyone. Uh, they, I mean, they go for your shop first. Actually, and that mostly goes for the shop first. Usually, night of or uh, human when they attack, they go for uh, your tier two buildings or your burrows. But in that, they just want the shop. Rawr, rawr. Slippers of Agility, a really nice item here for the Blade Master. Now he's going for the Renegade Wizard. Meanwhile, the Death Knight, he got a Mantle of Intelligence. Also a really nice item. Both players getting the best items so far. This Acolyte, can he get the last hit in? Kigami, 60 XP. No, Acolyte John. Acolyte John! Buy a Zeppelin. Cannot buy a Zeppelin. I mean, Blade Master kills the, uh, the Wizard and gets a Gloves of Haste. Meanwhile, the Death Knight, killing another Kobold. Gauntlet of Ogre Strength. Not as good as the Mantle of Intelligence, but... Uh, Probably deserves second prize here. Second best item. Is he going for the level 5? I think so. Pull out the creeps with the skeleton. And then he has a, a death knight here and three skeletons. To get this renegade wizard. And that's what he's doing. Mimo. The death knight here. Blade master here. Sells TP. Buys some healing. Buys a... Uh, scroll of speed. Can he, is he going to use it? If he knows Lucifer very well. He knows Lucifer is cre uh, creeping it. But even with the scroll of speed he wouldn't be in time. Okay. Sobi Mask, really nice item here for the Death Knight. He has so much mana regeneration now. 21 I uh, IQ plus the Sobi Mask. It's almost like he has uh, 31 and a half IQ. Look at this this uh, mana regeneration. Blade Master, gone by Berserker, of course. Let the killing begin. And uh, he wants his ogre, but Lucy, Lucy knows about it. Or does he not know about it? Wait, what? He saw there were no creeps, right? Wait, what? Uh, I guess Lucifer wasn't paying attention. It's already pretty late in Korea. I know he woke, woke up pretty early because he was streaming at like 9 a.m. his time this morning. And now it's like, what, 3 a.m. or so? What time is it? Hello. A player's forces are <sighs> Good. My chrome crashes. Great. The Death Knight and the Fiend go for the Rogue Wizard. Time. Soul. I don't know. Chrome is a uh, pretty shitty program, apparently. Death Knight is now level 2 and half. Okay, 6. Wait, what? Is it 6 a.m. already? Are you kidding me? Is it 6 a.m. right now? In yes, it's 6 a.m. So either Lucifer has been awake for uh, 21 hours, or maybe he took an afternoon nap. Anyway, the Death Knight, it's uh, he got a second gauntlet. The Blade Master is uh, he got a class of attack, so he does a lot of damage. This Cobalt is going down fast. Death Knight, oh, he takes so much damage from the Blade Master. He buys a staff, staffs out. He's, he's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. <laughs> he almost died there. If there was another critical strike and it would have hit, right? It didn't hit uh, the last attack, but by his healing potion, these two fiends though, can they 
Can they get around these grunts? This one is, is fine. This one is also fine with the Death Knight there. The Death Knight sells an item. Ooh, let's see if we can get another good item. Even steals mana from the wizard? Okay. Is it a circlet? He wants a circlet. He gets a ring of protection now. Oh, that's not amazing. This we're gonna creep over here. Blade Master just walking past, you know, just. I'm just seeing what's up, you know. Oh, the slaughterhouse could be cancelled. Easy peasy. Maybe even destroyed. He cancels it. Okay, these ghouls, they could, uh, yeah, they're afraid. They're afraid of a blade master, even though he doesn't have the orb. Death Knight very close to level three. Does he get it here? No, I don't. No, no. Thirty more XP needed. Shadow Hunter creeping with two grunts. There's a raider. There is a war mill. Pretty standard so far. Standard. Slaughterhouse can he cancel it again? Blade master just canceling it again. Just so good at cancelling uh, slaughterhouses, these blade masters. Going for a gargoyle, okay. Gargoyle. Blade master now working on the crypt. Look at the sneaky slaughterhouse. But the blade master, he has his eyes open. Or does he? Uh, yeah, he, ha he has his eyes open. Goes for the slaughterhouse again. And now another slaughterhouse over there. But the blade master, you know, he can cancel it again. And again, and again, and again, and again. It's gonna be cancelled again. But there's a gargoyle defending it. Look at this gargoyle doing so much damage to the blade master. The ghouls helping as well. There's a cancel in the slaughterhouse. The base is open now, but it's fine. He's an Arubian tower. Meanwhile, the death knight here killing some trolls. He's level three. The lich here is almost level two. Shadow hunter is still level two. There's a uh, another slaughterhouse. Blade master, not a cancel. Wow. And he cancels, cancels it again. There's another fiend. Are under There's a raider. There's a TC. There is uh, reinforced defenses. Is he expecting Zeppelin soon? Yeah, I mean, maybe. The gargoyle can uh, keep your eye on this goblin laboratory. Can also see separate incoming, but it's too supply to just uh, flying around. This for did you get this item? Yeah, he has two Sobi masks, so th at least that's something that went well for Lucifer. He got both this one and this one. He had to TP though. Don't think he lost anything because there was no blade master around. No, I don't see any dead fiends. Just the five dead creeps. And uh, I mean the blade master he staffed out. Great, Kikami Zulkis is almost level three, but not quite yet. Now the Lich has the orb. I mean Lucifer is ten supply behind though. Lucifer is ten supply behind. It's probably because the blade master was harassing, just uh, canceling so many slaughterhouses. There's a fake death knight. He doesn't kill the brigand. Let's the brigand live. Here come the raiders. It's brigand, one hit, one kill with the Lich, but he doesn't want to kill him. No, let them live. And there's a pocket expansion for for uh, focus. A player's forces are under attack. Here come the peons. Car. Car. Mantle of intelligence. Shadow hunter picks us up. He's so much smarter now. So smart. As an illusion. This fur is gonna finish off these creeps. Easy, uh, easy kill. There's one. Go for the next one. Here comes the Blade Master. And can he cancel more slaughterhouses? No, he, this slaughterhouse is up. Finally. He's going for Sepper. And where's that uh, gargoyle? Wait, where is the gargoyle? There he is. The scouting gargoyle. Do we see some Seppers? Is that a Sepper? That looks like a Sepper to me. But maybe to some of you, it looks like a Speech Cloud Sepper. The statue here. Can he block the Sepper? <laughs> maybe. Uh. Yes, he kills the Sepper. Are you kidding me? Oh, wow. 
Maybe Focus should have uh, blown out the Tomb of Relics. Blade Master doing so much damage against his statue, though. He gets a statue. But now Lucifer is going for this expansion. He sees it with a gargoyle. Blade Master. Uh, wait, did he sell his staff? Did he just rebuy the staff? I think he just rebought the staff. Yeah. I think he sold the staff before and now he rebuys it. So he's back. Here he is. And Lucifer, of course, he moves in here behind the town hall. Greatest joke, you know, the, with the, the illusion death knight. Uh, illusion death knight gets ensnared. Meanwhile, the peons are all dying. Nice 140 critical strike here on the illusion death knight. It looks like he has level 2 critical strike. Oh, and blade match takes so much nuke damage. Uh, but the statue is going down. Uh, the raider is also dead. This uh, 122 critical strike. There's a coil on the lich. Of course, he has uh, plenty of mana because of the two Sobi masks. Blade Master, he's, how long is he invulnerable for? It's, I guess the 15 second one. Berserker's now uh, under danger, under attack. There's coil no on the Blade Master, but the healing, uh, healing wave saves him. He took so much damage there. Focus is ahead in supplies, but. <laughs> Apparently, he cannot fight this fight. This Blade Master needs some healing self. And uh, he needs some more healing waves. This town, he wants to save this town hall. Meanwhile, Dark Ranger was she buying a TP and an info potion. This berserker is going down slowly. There was a the gargoyle was killed. You could hear the death sound. I didn't see uh, how he died, but he died. TC with the storm, the Dark Ranger trouble. She has an info potion and the TP. The Kodo eats a fiend, but the TC does go down. Level 4 death knight now. And uh, the fiend does get killed as well. This, this raider is going to die. Lucifer has to TP out and this Lich, you know, is he gonna be fine? He has one more coil, sure. This is fine. This is fine. But Lucifer couldn't break this expansion. He will have one more attack. One more attack in Lucifer. Can attack and destroy this expansion. Maybe later. I mean, the TC will be back in a moment. 36 seconds. 36. There's an abomination. I mean, there's two berserkers. There's raiders. The Kodo is still uh, devouring a fiend. Right. Lucifer needs a hero kill. Lucky hero kill. Or, or you know, skill for hero kill. Anything. Anything that kills a hero. Shadow Hunter is full mana. Uh, no shop here, no tower. You know, focus just goes over 50 supply here. I'm not sure if I like that. I would have liked to first see like a shop, like some towers, like two towers maybe even. Right, you know, Lucifer is gonna attack here again, and all you need to do is defend it, and then you win. And oh, there's a shop. Okay, there's a shop. This Kodo is still eating, still devouring this uh, fiend. Shadowhunter, of course, is do doing just fine. Uh, silence on the TC and the uh, Blade Master, but only after the uh, storm. But the uh, Blade Master might die. Use the Info Potion. He has an Info Potion, of course. Uh, why would you not have an Info Potion? The TC, though, he is going to die. This Abomination. No, he also has an Info Potion. Of course, he also has an Info Potion. There goes the fiend. There goes the uh, Abomination. Uh, Blade Master now has to retreat. And this Raider is also going down fast. Uh, Blade Master is taking a lot of damage. He will survive though. TC, of course, he survives as well. But now the heroes are kind of out of the fight for a little bit. The Shadow Hunter does have mana for more healing waves. This uh, the TC actually died. This Kodo eats a fiend, so tasty. This fiend is back on back. It's just one fiend and two statues and three heroes, of course. And the heroes with the statues are very strong. So th this statue does 20 hit points. Coil on the list. He has false armor. He's now going for the Blade Master. Blade Master is still alive. He's going for the Berserker. There goes the fiend. Uh, Lich takes so much damage. Can he kill the Lich? There's a mana for, you know, one more healing wave in a moment. But there goes another Berserker. Now let's go for these small little Berserkers. They are going to die as well. Lucifer has to win it here, right? He, he doesn't have much time because this expansion is paying off. It's uh, giving so much money here to focus. The Death Knight in trouble. Foss Armor is not going to save him. Does he have an Info Potion? Oh, yeah, on this Lich. Uh, he probably also has Death Pact. Oh no, he has level 2 and Holy Aura. Oh, okay. The Death Knight retreats with the statue. The Lich here could use a coil, perhaps. There it is. 
And, uh, well, the Death Knight is still alive here in the back. But uh, one in snare, one right click of the Blade Master kills the Death Knight. Is that a GG? We have an info potion on the Lich here that he could use. We have so many skeletons, even. Uh, Fiend and the skeletons. Uh, Lucifer used the info potion on the Lich. Dark Ranger, is she gonna survive? She survives for now. Uh, no, she's uh, dead. 136 uh, hit point. Uh, critical strike is maybe a little bit too much on a 5 hit point Lich. Hello. And there it is. GG. Focus wins 3-1 to one in the, you know, Capsule Cup Finals.